What's happening, YouTube? Well, working on the Velman Sound of Light kit. And uh, so far, it has proven to be frustrating. But it's self inflicted frustration because. That's actually what we're going for. We're not necessarily going for frustration, but I uh, want to uh, develop his problem-solving skills of mine, too, and uh, soldering techniques, as you can tell. We're fairly sloppy at it. Actually, I had my daughter doing it, and... Uh, She's really steady, and me and old Bud are uh, hyper as hell, but uh, I don't know if you can see that soldering job. It's not the best soldering job in the world. She did the resistors, so you can tell which ones she did. She did a real good job on it. Focus says me. But, uh, it's not working. So, and, uh, by the way, yes, I did put a battery in it. And, yes, I did go to the store and buy a brand new battery. You know, I know enough to know that. The negative has broken off for me flopping it around so much. But, uh, I don't know. It's, it ain't easy. But it sure. What the? I don't know. I'm, uh, oh, okay. That C1 there. I was looking at that C1 like there's supposed to be something there. But that's where the negative just broke off. So I gotta fix that. There's some other stuff I gotta do. We picked this one because it's kind of boring. It's not the most exciting thing in the world. I've got some remote control cars. But, uh, and, uh, some really cool stuff. But, uh, I'm gonna work on this. I thought I might have put this on backwards. Because C4 here, right here. It's got you got to put it in positive with negative but I'm I looked at that originally as this must be the ground and I was gonna switch it around but I'm pretty sure that that's that is the ground because there's nothing else on there that would indicate that it's anything other than that but this is why I, I got it. Oh, bud, he's kind of looking at me like, this sucks, it's like school. <laughs> I'm like, dude, you got to chill out, man. You got to understand that, you know, the reward of getting it done is going to be cool when it works. And then we can move on to the next one, but we're not going to move on to the next one until we get the first one. But this is... uh Part of my approach of the ham radio, I, you know, I'm I'm not so concerned about uh, talking to people. I mean, I've got CB radio. If I want to talk to somebody, and I still haven't even put the striker into the into the truck yet, I'm just I'm so used to. Uh, I'm not a big people person, so it's I'm just used to uh, you know being alone in the truck I'm fine with that but uh, someplace on this board there's a short that is not supposed to be there with that sloppy soldering job but that's what I'm trying to figure out is where in the heck is that short and the, this here was part of the problem, problem solving things when I was going and clipping off I was clipping off I think it was this side. Come on, focus. Gotta go back there. I was clipping one of these off and it separated from the board. 
and some of the green pulled up. You can see it right where the shadow is. Covering it, not covering it, covering it, not covering it. At the bottom of that yellow. Some of the green shellac or whatever the hell they put on top of this stuff came up. So I thought I may have, you know, broken the circuit there. So I put that little jumper and soldered that on there. That didn't fix it. So then I switched the battery out. That didn't fix it. I wanted a fresh battery. Um, something else I did. What did I do? Hmm. I checked all the positive, positives and negatives. Maybe that's all I've done. I haven't. This is odd here because there's there's a hole there like it's supposed to be, but I think that was just for a different trimmer. Yeah, there's nothing going in there, but it's just a direct line that. And if you look on the schematic over. Where's the trimmer? Right here, I think. Had the trimmer, yeah. That RV1 there on the schematic. That's the trimmer. Oh, come on. Give me a break. I know, it's just... Uh, put a lot of hours in on this stupid freaking for a blinking light but it's not about the blinking light it's not it's not about it you know being the coolest thing in the world but it's all about you know developing the skills and understanding of electronics and the persistence and the patience that's what this is all about and that's what we're doing tonight and I just kind of been looking at it for a while and you know, the temptation's there to go flip the TV on and watch Smokey and the Bandit, you know, but I'm resisting that temptation and I'm going to persevere and I'm going to drag old Bud along kicking and screaming, but I think it's it's frustrating and it's not the easiest thing to do in the world, but we're doing it together, father and son, and you know what? That's what this Christmas present was all about. And there's a bunch more to go. So after we get get done with this first one, you know, we'll move on to the next ones and the cooler soldering kits and stuff. Maybe we'll do breadboard next time so we don't have to, uh, you know, go through all this, make sure it all works and we got it lined up and do the, do the stuff. So, you know, I got a breadboard so we can figure that out. And, uh, and that's what we're doing. And uh, if you all were here, I'd give you a piece of this uh, cocoa dusted truffle as a Christmas present. But since you ain't here, <laughs> I'm gonna eat it. But uh, I got a buddy. He's a GM mechanic, and he's the guy that uh, tears the uh, dash off your car and finds the water leak and does all the shorts. You know, one thing I know is when you hit a brick wall, you go to somebody who knows a little bit more about it than you do. And I, he knows a lot more about circuits and electricity than I do, so I'll be going over there. I might record it. I might not. I don't know. It's kind of a pain in the butt to do recordings on this kind of stuff. But this is just to uh, kind of... Give you a little update on what's going on. You know, the whole licensing thing. I, you know. The girls don't seem to be interested in it. But. He, uh. Isn't in a big rush to do it. So I guess maybe I'll just do it myself and. Leave everybody in the dust and they can go back and look at the videos. I kind of wanted to learn together with them but maybe we'll just learn together you and me but uh we'll get her done they can go back and look at the videos if i put them up post them up you know and get it done that way adios muchachos <laughs>